Hi, I'm David Simmons. As some of you may know, I've written an Android app called Valence for remote controlling a computer from your phone. It's great for using a home theater PC from your couch, but I know it doesn't work for everyone. I hear you say, David, I'd love to use Valence, but I don't have an Android phone. My tablet is not an Android tablet. When are you going to support more platforms? Well, you'll be happy to know that as of today, Valence is officially multi-platform. I'm happy to announce the launch of Valence for the Commodore 64 home computer. Let's take a look at how it works. Here I have my home theater PC with my collection of MP3s and videos. I'd like to play some music, but I don't have a remote control handy. I don't have my Android phone on me. Uh, there is a keyboard hooked up to my PC, but I can't reach it. It's just too far. However, I do happen to have a Commodore 64 sitting right here. First, I'll power on the hardware. Remember, always turn on peripherals before turning on the main unit. Now I'll find my valence diskette. and insert it into the drive. To load the program, I'll simply type load, quote, star, quote, comma, eight, and press return. Ah, it's finished loading, so now I'll type run, press return, and the program will start. Now I'll press F1 to start the connection. I can now type on the PC using the Commodore's keyboard, or I can use the cursor keys or a joystick to control the mouse. It's as simple as that. And best of all, it's available today from calfbit.com. It will also be available on the C64 App Store just as soon as someone invents such a thing. One more thing. I know some of you have moved on from the Commodore 64 to more modern computers. So you'll be happy to know that Valence also runs great on the Commodore 128 in C64 mode. So there you have it. You can use Valence on Android smartphones, Android tablets, and yes, now the Commodore 64 home computer. Thanks for watching.